Hey, what's good, man? Appreciate y'all for tapping in with your boy today, man. But we're going to talk about it, G. All my people on TikTok, don't forget to follow the page. My people on Instagram, don't forget to follow the page. And everybody on YouTube, man, subscribe to the channel, man. Keep supporting your boy, man, <clears throat> as we move forward. Today, I want to talk about the Will Smith and Chris Rock situation, right? And I seen, I seen the Bad Boys movie. It was amazing, man. It's a great movie. You know what I'm saying? And um, a lot of people was feeling a certain type of way about the Chris Rock situation. And this is my thoughts about that, right? As men, we all make mistakes, right? And one of the things you have to do as a man when you make a mistake is an apologize. You can't have ego. Will Smith apologized to Chris Rock. Not only did he apologize to Chris Rock, he said he would have a sit down with Chris Rock. Now, I'm a big Will Smith fan, and I also rock with Chris Rock. And I feel like in his glorious moment, when he got his championship ring, which was his Oscar he'd been fighting for for years, he should have got it for Ali. Period. He should have got it for Ali. And many other movies that he done done, and he put in that pain, and he, he went out there, and he delivered at the highest level. And Will Smith, I'm talking about, he should have been had an Oscar. But Ali was the movie I really thought he should have got the Oscar for. Pursuit of Happiness, people think he should have got the Oscar for. And many others, right? Concussions, different movies that he done done that he really put that pain in. And he did a good thing. The day of the Oscar, I didn't even know he was getting nominated for an Oscar. I didn't even see that movie. That's the only move, Will Smith movie I've never seen, right? Not to get too far into that. Will Smith apologized, number one. He also said that he wanted to have a sit down with Chris Rock and discuss the, the, the issue that they had, right? And that's the thing that I always say, right? He said he was going to have a sit down. He apologized for what he did. Yes, it was a written apology. And some people feel like it's better when a person come on camera and, and stuff like that. That's why he decided he said he was going to have a sit down with Chris Rock. Chris Rock wasn't ready for the sit down. He wasn't ready for to do any of that because of the embarrassment and humiliation that he experienced at the Oscars being slapped like that in front of his people and being, you know what I mean, belittled in that form of fashion. My thing is he took the steps of making things right for the wrong that he did and us as human beings that's the only thing we can do now should we continuously bash will smith to this day because of that no because he took the steps in the right direction to make things right and that's how i feel about it you know what i'm saying i feel like if you take the direction of as a man when you wrong to make things right and the individual that you may have done wrong to he don't have to accept your apology he don't have to accept uh, having to sit down with you. He don't have to accept any of those things. But you was willing to do that as the person in the wrong to do those things. And he didn't want to do that. So at this point, I think the people that trying, was trying to bash Will Smith, you know what I mean, as he continuously has success in the movie business, you know what I mean, and his acting and things of that nature, him and Martin Lawrence, I feel like what can you really say if a man took multiple steps to clear his name, even though the person that he done, done the wrong to don't want to accept it, he did try to make things right with him by having to sit down because people didn't wasn't feeling the the written apology. They wanted they, they wanted him to do it in person or you know what I mean say it on the video or stuff like that. But like I say, what's what's the bigger and better thing to do to have a sit down and, and we talk a uh, man to man, either behind cameras or in front of cameras. But it's it's it take a lot for a person to be in a position of power to have the type of money the influence and the things that will smith has to even say i want to apologize at all when you may have thought you was in the right and it could have been it was an emotional action that he felt at that moment and it happened you know what i mean and it was a mistake i felt like it was on his uh glorious day of getting the oscar getting his championship ring and it just went all out of hand you know what i mean not to take away all the good work he put in the past that's one thing that happens to our community You'll do one little wrong thing and everything you ever done good will be erased. And that's just society in general. You know what I mean? You could be the goodest man and the goodest person ever. And you make that one mistake and that one mistake will, will define you, your character as a person and everything about you. When it's wrong, when people do that. All right. But like I said before, man, I feel like he took the steps to make things right. And it's on the other person to say, I want to do it or I don't want to do it. And Chris Rock didn't want to have no sit down and Chris Rock wasn't having it, but Will did his part. So we can't come on the platforms, the different uh, 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 speaking platforms and say we still got to bash Will when Will took the steps. So that's my thoughts and opinions on that, man. Y'all give me y'all thoughts and opinions in the comment section, man, which y'all feel and things of that nature. But that's my thoughts on the Will Smith and Chris Rock situation.